Hey, welcome back to Once Upon a Game. I'm Kevin Kitchens, and in this episode, I am going to do an unboxing of the very long-awaited Agents of Mayhem expansion, the Athena AI, the solo cooperative mode. This was uh, the Agents of Mayhem uh, Kickstarter fulfilled many years ago. I, think I want to say like at least two, at least three years ago. And uh, this has been in the works. This is uh, from Academy Games, so the people that gave us the great solo AI for Conflict of Heroes, Awakening the Bear. This is the next iteration of somewhat of the same system, my understanding is, that allows you to play Agents of Mayhem, which is normally a uh, player versus player, uh, uh, mayhem versus um, legion, uh, combat, uh, tactical, you know, combat game, 3D, that's some cool 3D terrain, uh, boards, things like that that you that you play on. So this is the deck or the, the uh, expansion that allows you to play solo or like I said, co-op. So um, one, one thing of note is that as of the time I'm recording this, uh, which is uh, Monday night, uh, November, <laughs> November, which is Monday night, um, well, actually, it's early Tuesday morning uh, where I am. It's uh, June 18th, 2024. So this is going to be on display, I believe, at Origins starting Wednesday. Uh, it supposedly has been shipped out to the backers who have already bought this back when they, you know, backed the game and have been waiting to play it. I've got it sitting on my shelf. I did not back the Kickstarter. I picked it up, uh, picked up the whole system. Uh, second hand, but I've uh, been waiting on this to come out to, sh to show you. A lot of people have been waiting on it. It's had its production issues. It's had its perfectionist issues. There have been a number of delays, but anyway, all that in the past, it's here now. If you still have the game on your shelf, you want to make sure you get this if you've been waiting to play. So anyway, as of the time I'm recording this though, there is a um, QR code on the back. Um, they do not they do not include a rule book in this. Um, I actually had a discussion with uh, uh, the team uh, and I suggested, you know, since they were trying to get the rule book right so they could print it, I was like, well, I'll just, you know, do the rule book digitally um, because if, you know, Academy's known for constantly uh, evolving their rule books. Um, Conflict of Heroes has had many different rule books. Uh, you know, where they upgrade, you know, they upgrade the system, they upgrade the rules. So. Uh, so, you know, it's probably not a big rule book. The problem is I've not seen it. So they've got a QR code on the back, which I'll pop up on the screen too, uh, that will let you download the rule book from their Dropbox uh, rules library. The problem is it's not there. <laughs> I think they're in transit to Origins and we're so busy getting this released that they forgot to put the rule book on there. So I know they're working on that now. Um, I am hoping to get some rules here. Uh, I was hoping to get a, a copy sent to me as well so I could kind of go over how it works, but we will muddle through here. I'm going to go ahead and get this out and maybe by the time the video is, before I finish the video, uh, my inbox will ding and I will be able to go over that. But anyway, all of that being said, and here's a, here's a closer look at the Athena. Oh, let's get some lights on it there. The Athena AI. So, without further ado, let's crack it open and see what comes inside. All right, so it comes in a, uh, a uh, you know, a uh, chipboard uh, box, you know, not a, not a covered box, but it uh, you know, opens up like that. And we have inside two decks of cards with a divider. There are 140 cards. And the back says, play Agents of Mayhem solo or co-op against the Athena AI. Athena makes decisions quickly based on mission and unit focused objectives and what Athena anticipates you will do. Athena's modular AI Deck customizes how it behaves, offering a dynamic opponent that uses unique tactics in each mission. The solo consists of 
140 cards, Athena AI order cards, mission unit focus cards, refresh cards, summary cards. Obviously you need the game to play it. Uh, and again, this is the QR code where you can download the rule book. And as I mentioned at recording time, they are not presently available. So here are the cards, the decks sealed and we'll open them up. All right, so these are the two decks as they were wrapped. Um, looks like we've got some, some rule cards here. All right, late actions, block, uh, backside we've got area effect summary, block, and golems actions, protected, and cloak, and defensive dash, dash check. So the summary of how those rules work. There may be some more mixed in here. So then we've got the mission focus cards right here. All right, we're gonna try to sort these out first here. So let's, and that's the mission focus. Summary cards. And then we've got some unit focus cards. So the unit has a particular focus. So you're gonna draw that. It would be very helpful to have the rules and I'm sure as soon as they're available, everybody will look at them here. And then we've got some cards here. These are by the two teams. And then we've got a Mayhem card for unavailable and Mayhem available. So really what you're getting is a, is a big bundle of cards and then the AI. And it looks like, it looks like this is a lot of the AI deck. In fact, here's a couple more summary cards at the end of that other deck. We've got Elite Redeployment, Hacking, Squad Reinforcing, Squad draw phase. So put those here in the summary deck. And then we've got what appear to be the actual Athena AI. The various titles. And then what you're going to do move, attack, move, attack, mission focus. Again, I wish. And that's the back of those right there. Again, I do wish. A little more guidance here on how this is going to work. It's not looking fully familiar to me based on the Conflict of Heroes uh, uh, AI. It looks somewhat similar, like you're going to start at the top and based on these conditions, do these things here, and it's got largest group unshielded, which probably references something else here. But mainly, just seeing this, helps prove that it does exist. They have a, the cards have a nice, they do have a faux linen finish. I don't know if you can see the kind of texture on there, but you don't really feel it. So they are pretty, pretty thick. I mean, obviously you're gonna to wanna to price leave these for shuffling purposes and everything. But, uh, I mean, they're pretty, pretty good standard card quality. I mean, there's nothing to, to complain about there, but it's just a matter of how these work Hopefully by the time this video releases tomorrow, you will be able to download the rules to that QR code that we saw. Take another look here. So we got unit focus, unit focus cards, the targets of VIP, set up, place a reference marker on this card that matches the reference marker on a random enemy that provides the AI the most points if it is downed or could provide the player the most points if it is not downed. Right. Fall damage, gadget highest level, closest range protected, unit focus. Again, hard to know what these instructions mean, but the cards exist. Now we just need the rules. Sniper. So there's a unit focus and the mission focus. We'll get a couple of those there. So shift focus. Set up the mission ends with a different mission focus cards. 
Then it starts with place the starting mission focus card face up with the ending mission focus card face down under it. Mission focus target VIP. Place a reference marker on this card that matches the reference marker on a random enemy that provides the AI the most points. If it is downed, it could provide the player the most points if it is not downed. So we have, like I said, we have unit focus, excuse me, mission focus, unit focus cards, summaries, the Athena AI cards, and then there's this Mayhem card available, Mayhem card unavailable. If the AI has two Mayhem cubes on any AI boards at the end of its turn, the AI will spend two Mayhem cubes to flip this card to its available side. So there's a little instructions there. And then here we've got our Mayhem and Legion cards here. And again, not really sure what these are doing. Most wounds, fewest shields, fewest cubes. Maybe who you're targeting. Target the one with the fewest cubes, protected and has the fewest shields tiebreakers kind of thing that would be my guess as to who they're targeting and then this one is whoever has the most mayhem who's protected who's fewest shields so it appears to be this is how you choose the unit maybe that they're going to target or that's going to attack so a couple other add-ons that they sent were the uh, gremlin tech deck as well as the Hammer Tech deck. And we have these for Legion as well as for Mayhem. So if Mayhem is becoming too much of a nuisance, Hammer Tech is guaranteed to end their existence. Brought to you by the renowned Legion weapon designer Hammersmith, these next generation weapons will provide new strategies and power your enemies can only dream of. So you got this one for Legion, seven cards, Doomsday Device, Self Destructive Armor, Sunbeam, Heliporter. Eclipse the Sun, Distort Reality, and Hammer Tech Artillery. And then for your Evil Mayhem, you can have Gremlin Tech cards. We have Auto Target, Gutter Ball, Hardened Hull, Mayhem Star, Moonbeam, Mulligan, and Quick Break. So those are those two decks as well. I don't know if these are something you would order separately if these were promised in the original kickstarter but they did send them along because they're now available so anyway i checked and i still do not have the rules so uh, and I, this is normally normally i'm a little more uh a little less scattered here as i'm doing these unboxings but this just came in today i wanted to make sure this got out as soon as possible if you've ordered it already, you should be expecting it. If you have not, I'm sure they've made extra copies that will be available. So anyway, if you pick up the Agents of Mayhem expansion, the Athena AI solo cooperative mode, you're going to get these 140 cards. I'm not going to really do a reboxing. You will get the 140 cards. Um, and then you'll have to, as I said, you'll have to download from this QR code from the Academy Dropbox folder for its uh, Agents of Mayhem rule books that they have they have the existing system rule books on there um, and this will give you the uh, this will give you the rule book eventually hopefully it'll be there tomorrow hopefully by the time you're watching this it will be there anyway that is what comes in the Athena AI solo cooperative mode for Agents of Mayhem thank you so much for watching thank you for putting up with the uh, little bit of technical weirdness that's going on here and uh, God bless you. Bye-bye.